The Platinum Pageant was packed full of adorable moments as the royal children stole the show. But while the world's eyes were firmly on the adorable cheeky chappy Prince Louis, there were plenty of heartwarming moments exchanged between the other royals as well. Despite having her hands full with her own brood, the Princess of Wales, Catherine, showed off her mothering instinct as she embraced another restless little one. The moment was captured in a short clip posted on Twitter by a fan of the royals. At one point during the celebrations in the royal box sitting between Princess Catherine and Princess Charlotte, it appeared that Mia was upset, so she climbed over the chair in order to curl up onto Catherine's lap and rest her head on the royal shoulder. The mother of three tenderly stokes in Mia's arm and fixes her hair braid as she whispers something to the young girl. Even little Princess Charlotte noticed that and offered a kind gesture of rubbing her back to comfort her. Mia later experienced a change of heart, adorably rocking out to an ABBA song with Peter Phillips' daughter Savannah. The cousins had fun belting out Dancing Queen and coordinating blue dresses, and Mia was smiling while clapping her hands over her head. Mia's other pageant highlights were captured on film, including a fight with her sister, Lena. When the toddler smacked her arm, Mia returned the favor before Dad Mike Tiddle put a stop to their bickering. Later, Mia cracked up as Louie kissed her nose. Middleton seated one row in front of Mia, had her hands full with the rambunctious prince as she watched the people's pageant. She spent a portion of the festivities getting Louis to behave. He first was being seen with his dad, Prince William, then passed to his mother, and he finally made his way to the lap of his grandfather, King Charles. Mike was also seen engaging in a sweet moment with Prince Louis, who stole the show with his reactions and facial expressions. The former rugby player joked and pulled faces at the younger prince during the parade to keep him entertained. The royal appeared to be in high spirits following the success of the spectacular event as they all interacted with each other during the parade. It was an extremely busy four days. The kids were exhausted and probably the adults as well, but I'm so thankful they shared their children with all of us. Catherine was being mom and auntie to them all and doing a wonderful job. We also really love how close the Waleses are to the Tiddles and other private sweet moments. It's like we get a glimpse of how they are private. I feel like they all know each other really, really well and comfortable with each other. Also, the Wessex family with them all, they are often seen out together during various family occasions. During the Commonwealth Games in Birmingham last year, Princess Catherine greeted Lady Louise Windsor with a double kiss on the cheek. The princess was seen wearing a all-white three-piece suit as Princess Charlotte sported a smart drip dress that featured a Peter Pan-style collar. Prince William wearing a navy suit and beige trousers followed after his wife and greeted his aunt, uncle, and young cousins. Sophie Wessex was also seen sharing a hug with Catherine as Princess Charlotte greeted her extended family members. Lady Louise was spotted on the fourth day of the games wearing the same 980 pound Peter Paletto dress that her mother Sophie Wessex wore on the Chelsea Flower Show in 2015. She looked the spitty image of her mother as she sported the half up half down hairstyle. Sophie Wessex was seen wearing a tailored white trouser and pink blouse, with Prince Edward and son James wearing smart shirts and trousers for the event.